Yo, ask me in the cut. Yeah. Yeah. Kenzie. Yeah, yeah. How to trial by trial. Who wants to support him? Nod. Nod? Yeah. <laughs> what's your name? Kai. Kai, what's your position? I am the president of X U Media. Yes, ma'am. Graduated senior. Graduated senior. She gonna be gone. I got two more years and she ain't gonna be here. That's. Love. Black. Black. Good cards. Okay. So I'm a black. Make your track. That you're in my camera. Don't look. Are y'all actually filming? Oh, well, okay. Okay. I'll show you. So basically, black is beautiful. Back chronics, bro. I'm trying to remember the the lyrics. What you do is you have your card. Chronics. Chronics. Y'all know that's a that's a Western Indian artist. I don't know that. I know they're from it. My president is black. Black blue. And you can choose any They're black Fenta. And you know, just talk about how, you know, the relationship. And how, you know, it's dialect. You're putting the camera too much. You're doing it. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. I've got a phone. Sean, figure out how to move. Uh, what else can I say? I just want you to know, Adam's gonna put this somewhere crazy. He was like, oh. I don't know my new friends, guys. Is that what? <laughs> I'm gonna get out of the way. I'm gonna go crazy. Huh? Adam. Huh? The very lovely Adam. It's director Adam in the cut. You know, new production set. Uh, I got this mic recently from uh, Amazon. It cost me about uh, two bands. You know, I got money. Um, got this uh, new camera. It cost me about thirty thousand uh, dollars. Funded by uh, Bill Gates himself. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Plugging the bill. Uh, Mike, I think I already showed you this. Cost about six hundred. You know what I'm saying. That's a uh, pocket change for me. You know what I'm saying. Uh, real gold chain. Very real. You know what I'm saying. It cost me about. Uh, Three bands. Three bands. Simple. Simple man. You were the orphan who starts the statement as I'm not racist, but it's his family. It's not my family. What can you do with I'm not racist compared to the KKK, the actual racist? The actual racist cutthroat organization? Make that decision. That's the right, Connor. Take college way too seriously. I don't mean like no one takes cautious. I mean they take themselves too seriously in college. I do. You know what I mean? Like we're 20, 21, 19 years old. Like we can have fun in college. Don't be looking for be like, yo, you too goofy. Like, yo, swear y'all can have like, fun, bro. bro Even as a year. There's a lot to do. Oh. The city is rich in culture and history. We in New Orleans, bro. You get lost in the like, city. You know? Don't get lost. Exactly. No, 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 no. Yeah, go to go to Metairie, go downtown, go to Bourbon. You know, go down, go experience the culture right. of the city. You know, you don't need to go out and club like every night. Go see a museum. Go. I was something. gonna say that, bro. It'd be so many museums, especially like Garden the District, bro. Chinese Museum, the Museum of Death, the African American Art Museum, Louis Armstrong Park. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, because, nice day you know, spots too. The city Park. And stuff like that, What's good with y'all, man? You know what I'm saying? Got the little pumping today. Know how to get that work in, bro. But I can't even lie. I can't even record it, bro. I was just so into it today. Like, workout today was kind of personal. You know, today was just me versus me. Like, in the truest sense of it. Like, I hit the treadmill first, you know, did my little warm up half mile jog. I usually do one mile, but like, it was going to be intense, you know, just doing uh, weights today. So, just did half a mile. Did three sets of 10 on the chest press machine. Went like 10 pounds heavier than I usually do on everything. On the three by 10 for chest press. Um, did shoulder press. Uh, same thing, 10 by 10. I mean, three by 10. Uh, increased the weight from last time to like 10 pounds. And then curls each arm. Um, same thing, just three by 10. But that's what even the hardest of the workout. I did sit-ups. Did about uh, two sets of 25 for crunches, two sets of 25 seconds for crosses. My feet went like that, and then up, down, same thing, two by 25. 
then I finished it, finished it off. Originally, I was gonna do just uh, 25 crunches to finish it off, but it, this is when the personal side kicked in. I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna go for 100, just to see if I can do it, right? I haven't done 100 crunches since I was in high school. Bruh, not gonna lie. When I hit like 25, I thought I was done. But I'm telling you, bro, like, it's that voice in your head that be telling you, like, you can't do something or you shouldn't do it because it's going to tear you down mentally. You know, somebody it's somebody else's job to get whatever it is that you know in your heart you want to get done. Bro, if it's in your heart to do, just do that shit, bro. Just do that shit, bro. If you don't believe in yourself for anything, bro, you're not going to stand for anything that's going to sustain, sustain you well enough in a way where you can wake up every day and genuinely feel like you're waking up for your purpose. Because you're not doing something that is going, that's going to involve a little bit of suffering, a little bit of pain, but it's towards something that you believe in, then whatever it is that you're doing that's not that, it's a waste of your time, bro. In my opinion, like I'm not knocking anybody that's you no, know, just trying to like make their ends meet, ends meet or whatever, you know, trying to get off their feet for whatever reason. But I'm telling y'all, bro, that has to come to a point in your life where you just like, man, I don't care what nobody say, I'm about to bet on myself with this, this right here, betting on myself. What if it's music, bet on yourself. Rap, bet on yourself, bro. You a chef. Bet on yourself. Open that restaurant. Business, bet on yourself. You know what I'm saying? Put that thing into an LLC. Get your money and stuff together. It's a process, bro. It's a long, tough process, but it's worth it, bro. I promise you, bro. I promise you it's worth it.